YouTube, my name is Danica and today I want to do a quick discussion video. So if you've been following my channel, you might have noticed that I've been reading a lot of Tamora Pierce books this year. So although I have always heard about Tamora Pierce, this year was the first time I've actually read any of her books. So I started with the Alana Quartet and have been reading them in publication order and I'm on to the fourth series by her. As I'm reading them, and I enjoy them a lot now, I keep thinking that I wish I had read these as a kid because my little tiny feminist self would have adored these books. They are so feminist, not just girls can do stuff too, but also in showing positive relationships between women and talking about consent. Just everything that girls need to hear. They're still really enjoyable to read now, but I think it would have been very helpful to me at a young age. So when the Alana Quartet came into my work, I bought them for my niece, who is nine now, and they might be actually a little bit beyond her right now, but I want her to be able to read them at a younger age to get that kind of experience that I wish that I had had. And it made me think about what sort of books that I wish I had read sooner. Tipping the Velvet is kind of a funny choice for me because I often talk about it as being the exact right book at the right time for me, which is true. I read Tipping the Velvet after I was kind of coming out of a not very healthy relationship in high school. It was my first relationship and it wasn't very healthy for either of us. Tipping the Velvet made me reconsider my sort of weird romanticized versions of what love had to look like and made me realize that love can be a lot of things and that healthy relationships are not always your first love, that you had love at first sight and all of these really romantic, Disney-fied ideas, that love can be different than that and can be better for it. And it was really what I needed to read at the time, but I feel like if I had been able to read it earlier, before I got completely into this four-year relationship, or maybe during the first year or two, Maybe that could have saved me a lot of hurt, but also maybe I wouldn't have been receptive to that idea at that point. But in hindsight, I wish I could have read this sooner. Who knows if that actually would have worked. The other one I was thinking of was Ruby Fruit Jungle by Rita Mae Brown. This was the first queer book I read, and it started my whole journey into lesbian literature. It was a great first book to read. If you're looking for a book to kind of initiate you to the genre, this is a classic and it's fantastic. It's still a really fun read now. But I wish that I could have read lesbian books when I was first coming out or even before I came out, before I was even questioning. I think that would have been really valuable. In the We Need Diverse Books campaign, lots of people have submitted pictures with themselves with a sign that says, we need diverse books because, and David Levithan's sign was, we need diverse books because you don't always know you're the gay kid. And that's really true, that it's really important that we have diverse literature, especially for kids, because you don't always know to look for queer literature, because you don't always know that you're queer, or trans, or whatever. You don't you're still discovering yourself and you need those examples to be able to know that they're an option. So I wish that my 13 year old, 14 year old self had been able to read something like Ruby Fruit Jungle or any lesbian teen books. I really think it would have blown my mind if I had been reading Julianne Peters then. I was still a teenager when I started reading them, but I think starting them even sooner would have been even better. So those were a couple of my picks of books that I love, but I wish I had been able to read sooner. What are your picks? Are there books that you wish you had been able to read as a kid, or just earlier in your life? Did you ever read a book and think, I could have used this at some earlier point in my life? That would have helped me a lot. Let me know in the comments, or make your own video about it. I would love to see it. And thank you for watching. Bye!